Hi guys, and welcome back to Defying Bloxy. In today's video, we'll discuss all working Roblox-scented con games. Before we get into it, all the games we want to clarify that scented con games are a shame and you should not play these. Let's head into it. Survive the Killers. In this game, there's a significant amount of violence involved. The youngsters have weapons, some of which are one of a kind, which they use to murder other players. The animations in this game are wonderful, but it is not recommended for children under the age of 13. In this game, there's a serial killer looking around an area or a room looking for kids, and he ruthlessly kills or stabs them as he goes. This game may be prohibited as a result of the graphic violence it contains. By the way, do you hate scented con games? Let us know in the comment section down below. Haha <laughs> Winky Face Haha <laughs> Winky Face was the name of a Roblox game that was played. It was a perfumed con game, to be sure. When a youngster initially entered this game, there were just a few players miling about a pool surrounded by palm trees at a party house built by a gang known as the Cons, who were a collection of bad things. In actual life, this mansion may have been used as a cooperate event felicity. One could see its open foyer crammed with Chinese managers wearing name tags and swilling sour red wine. The cons were evidently planning on getting their visitors involved in adult activities as well. It'd be it of a different nature. In their den, they had a selection of adult toys on display for visitors. The single beds in the private rooms on the second floor were a nice touch. The basement served as an adult dungeon, with torch lights illuminating the area. The haha -ha home would ultimately be visited more than 600 times by gamers during its brief existence, but for the time being, it remained virtually unnoticed. The only thing that moved the soul alone was a male figure in the open concept kitchen of the house, reclining on the breakfast bar and staring at the ceiling. The motions near his polygons in the pelvis pleased him and he took a pleasure in assessing them. A person in another portion of the home requested another private gaming server so that they may enter an identical empty clone of the party house and continue their interactions with the other players there. Meep City Alex Neutron designed Meep City as a social hangout roleplay game for his friends. It was designed in the manner of casual multiplayer online games for children and it included elements that were influenced by, as well as several allusions to the Universal Studios, Toontown Online, and Club Penguin. The major goal of the game is to serve as a social or role-playing hangout. This implies that purchasing products or participating in games in, in it is absolutely voluntary. To sell your fish, you must first visit a pet store and proceed to the counter, where you must pick the sell fish option, then select the fish you wish to sell. Selling fish frees up room in your bucket, allowing you to continue fishing until your bucket is completely empty. Obby Games There is a sequence of interconnected pages in which the youngsters go from one location to another after accomplishing the chores on each page in the book. Each page continues to contain a unique set of tasks, and the players must successfully complete the assignments in order to proceed. Every page showcasing wicked toys in the animations has difficult tasks waiting for the players to do. When the youngsters are out and about, monsters and horror-themed items stand in their way, preventing them from completing the challenges and frightening the children. What do you think about these scented con games? Did you know they exist? Let us know in the comment section. And this brings us to the end of today's video. I hope you had fun watching it. Give us a like if you did, and subscribe to our channel to stay updated. Also, activate the bell so you definitely won't miss any of our future uploads. And watch the two videos on screen, because I'm sure you'll love at least one of them. Enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!